Hello and welcome to Robot Showdown Series 1 Heat A Part 1. Never did I think this day would come quite like this, but I must say I this is the most excited I've ever felt in all of fan made Robot Wars. Here we are with the very first heat of the very first real series of Robot Showdown. This is Robot Showdown 747 here, and of course I have done others, but they've been practice series. And I've done my first and second untelevised series, which I'll talk about some other day. Anyway, um, I have a few small notes to make just before we kick off with round one. Anyway, so here we are with the arena. We've got a camera view from here, and then we'll have a camera view from here when we want to look in there. You can see the tripod's kind of quite weak today. It's kind of floppy and everything, but most tripods are. Um... Let's take a look at the best, one of my favourite things now. We've got spectators, Star Wars spectators. Sir Palpatine, I don't like him. Um, some guy with a shotgun, don't know how he got in here. Terrorist. And Darth Sidious, looking uglier than ever. There we go. So we'll just put them back up. But there, because they're senior people, they get to spectate on top of the top balcony. Then, behind here, you can see we've got other people. And then behind here, we've got other people. So yes, I I assure you, my friends, this is going to be an amazing series. Now, anyway, um, as you might remember, one the intro cut off by accident. Well, not by accident. I, I it was going to go over 11 minutes. So the thing I wanted to add is, um, in the description for the intro, I've put up hyperlinks of all the people I'd like to thank and for people to check out their channels and those. Are those are people like Robot Boys Revenge, Launch 1995, Robot Great War 2, Master Aff, Alex the 15th, Lego Junk 96, Homebot Wars, Roscoe Whitey. Please check out his new series, Ross's Robot Wars. It is, in, it is badass. I watched it earlier. It's a really good series. And finally, um, the other person whose name is Zeroed Out. That's it. In on for you two, Robot Wars. And other people like Static Super Saiyan 3, Extreme Rules. 13, Team Extremer, that's that, basically. Anyway, let's, it's pretty much, it's about time we've gone on the music, we're going to have Jack 2 music for this, so let's just move around the side, so we can take a look at today's competitors. This is it, people, this is Robot Showdown Series 1, Heat A, Round 1, oh, sorry, Robot Showdown Series 1, Heat A, Part 1, Round 1, here we go. First on, on the final thing I have to say is, if you want to see the profiles of the robots, so I, it would take too much time to use Windows Movie Maker for every part, look in the description of the video. Okay. First one on. The Almighty Chaos 2. It's got a great CO2 flipper. An amazing machine. It's done very well in Robot Showdown so far. It's actually got a better flipper than Downtown Kia, if you ask me. Certainly one of my contenders for the title, if you ask me. I'm just making sure... We're catching this, and yes, we are. And by the way, the robots are coming out from the alley. Down there. Okay. Touch that one. Next one, we have Sensol, a rally car. Very smashed up and battered. I've had this for about 12 years, so since like 1999 or something. 1998, yeah. It's got plenty of acceleration. It's the far. It's no new robots around as the robot with the most acceleration so it is quite deadly a lot of people think sensol could do very well it's a ford sassol rally car it was made in italy so shocking this is an italian team we'll have to see how that goes now we have one of the worst robots this one didn't appear in the box of my series update because i couldn't find it this is the head it's got crushing pincers it's the head of a bionicle a red the one of the red bionicles can't remember its name it's not bad, but it has no. It's got a screen net, but it's really. Oh, that's not it. That's it. Yeah, but it's really unreliable. It's not really that good. I don't see this one making it far. And last but not least, of another robot that didn't appear in my box of my series, Nuke. Now it actually was in the. It's actually I've covered this there, as a matter of fact. But anyway, this is um. Sorry, I just have to move back a bit. But anyway, this is a I. An um, eyeglass, it's got a 360 degree spinning disc, it's very good, it's invertible as well, 
And even when it gets stuck on its side, it has the most incredible scream hack. It just does that. I think this one could do well, but its light body will make it bad. In the description, it must only weigh about 10, 15 grand, if you ask me. So now, bring them on, the house robots, for the very first battle. And into the house robot corner cam, we have Cripple Lot, or sorry, Amiga Killer Lot, for the first battle with those crushing pincers. The only house robot able to south right. So, uh, I said south right. <laughs> Stuff right, I made you kill a lot of southern accent. <laughs> and finally, after him, we've got Matilda with the lifting tusk. You see, there's no one down the alleyway, 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 whatever. Now, and the music is going to be the Jack 2 Haven City High Alert theme. Turn up the volume a touch, but we can't have it on too loud. Okay. Cripple lot over there. Matilda over there. That's actually a better camera angle. Unless, sorry about this. I'm just checking the camera. Angles. Actually, no, that's better. Here we go. Three, two, one. Activate. Let the first battle of Robot Showdown Series One begin. Go. Okay, send soul charging in. Chaos two. Flipping nuke, flying up into the air. Nuke, using that 360 degree spinning disc, the sensor. Oh. And Chaos 2 driving into a mega kill lot CPZ, but just drives away. There's the head, scrubbing around on the floor. Sensor. Chaos 2, flipping it up on its side. Meanwhile, I've just forgot a real. Sensol. Didn't think he'd last long. Anyway. Chaos 2 coming in. The head all the way over here is trying to make a hasty retreat, so even though he's just dived straight back in, he got flattened by Nuke. Uh, Chaos 2's annoyed Matilda, but tough with Matilda because she's just got flipped up onto the side. Self-righted back into the arena. It's activated the pit release. Now there's a gap in the arena wall. And Nuke. Oh, he's out! Now that's a shock. Cease. You can see Matilda up on the side wall. She'll be taking her retirement time. Cripple lot didn't do much. Didn't have to. Shockingly enough, the head, I don't think it deserves to make it through. And Chaos 2, they go through. Well, look at that. It's a nice flip. And there we go again. So, Chaos 2, the winners go up here, by the way. Chaos 2 and the head go through. While Sensol, we've got flying out the arena like Chaos 2 didn't do anything that Italian machine better luck next time to them now 
nuke down here. I think they deserve to go through, but unfortunately there are no second chances in my series. They are out. I don't reckon fans are going to like the head, though, for that. Alright. In a moment, we'll end part one. So I will usually we'll be able to do two battles, the first round, the first two round, well, basically the round one battles, but all the introduction and everything has made it take a bit longer, but that was a great first battle. So. We'll see you guys. Part two, stick around.